students which we are holding tomorrow at Sumaya Vidya Vihar University tomorrow and day after. Uh, the topic at this for you is on the future of work and skill development. So first I tell you a little bit about AIU and then we'll talk about this conference and then we'll hand over to the president of AIU. Uh, AIU is the largest university association in the world. So in India we have around 1100 universities. Out of that around 986 universities are the members of AIU. And AIU is a body which looks after the universities in terms of handholding. We do a lot of programs for the universities for uh, say in academics, research, we do equivalence of foreign degrees with Indian degrees, which is a mandate given to us by the government of India. We also believe in the holistic development of the students. We do a lot of activities for the students in terms of having a student research convention, which is called Alvation. This year we are digitizing and internationalizing Alvation. We do a lot of sports programs for them. We do a lot of youth festivals for them. And we do bring out many, many research publications, including university news, which is very important. So every year we hold six conferences of Vice Chancellor because we want to bring Vice Chancellor on a common platform where we can discuss and deliberate on the issues which are of, which are of seminal importance. And every year we have a national conference, one national conference and five regional conferences, which are East, East, West, South, North, and Central. So this year, we for the main conference, we have the theme Higher Education at 2047. That what will be higher education like in the year 2047 when India celebrates 100 years of its independence. And uh, as a sub-theme of that for India, Higher Education at 2047, we have five conferences at five places in India. So this is the third conference we are holding. Earlier today, Southern Conference was held in which Vishwaraya University of Technology, which was on the theme of digitization, how to uh, use technology for higher education, teaching, learning, research, and learning. There was another conference in uh, Guwahati in the Royal Global University, which one, which was on Indian knowledge system and how to integrate Indian knowledge system into modern education. And this conference, which is in Swaya Vidya uh, Vihar. This is on future of work and skill development, that how we should be skilling our population, how we should be skilling our students so that they become a, uh, they become employable graduates and they are there because the younger population is the future of India. So how the future of work, they will be able to sort of handle that because the work dynamics are changing very, very fast. Every day the work dynamics are changing. So how the students have to be equipped to take care of future requirements in the workspace. And we will be having three sessions in this conference, and those three sessions again are very important. One will be on sustainable careers, navigating a dynamic works, work landscape. Second will be on human-centered skills in a tech-driven world. Like in which we will be talking about soft skills and emotional intelligence. And one session will be on internationalization of national education, or on implementation of national education policy. Special with special reference to future of work and education. So this is given in the press release which has been shared with you. And uh, the Honorable Governor of Maharashtra, he is coming to inaugurate the conference tomorrow. Uh, for the valedictory, we are having the Dr. T. P. Srinivasan, he is the IFS retired, he is the former ambassador and permanent representative of India in the United Nations. And apart from that, there will be one AIU business session. There will be uh, one session in which we have interface with the regulatory bodies in which we invite UGC, AICT, NAC, and ICR for the <coughs> of our vice chancellors. I'm sure the, the conference